Soon after the open beta 9 update for OnePlus 7 Pro users, we started receiving the stable build for the same device. For people who were running Oxygen OS 10.3, they should receive a new OTA update via system update section which will be Oxygen OS 10.3.1. Few users have already received this update but if you guys haven't received like me then you can download the Oxygen OS updater application and you should have a new update available. The incremental update size is 244 MB. I'll give a direct link in the description below of the incremental update. You can download that file and do a local upgrade. Let's download this file using Oxygen OS updater application. To do a local upgrade, what you need to do is just download the file and place it inside the internal storage of your device. You need to place the file inside the internal storage. Once it's done, you just go to settings, system, system update, tap on the gear icon towards the right top corner, select local upgrade and choose the update file. Tap on install now. Once the installation process is completed, you can reboot your device. Device have been successfully updated. Let me show you the software information first by going to settings, about phone. Here you can see Android version is Android 10. Build number is Oxygen OS 10.3.1. Security patch is 1st Jan 2020. This update is basically for Indian region because we have almost all the changes related to India region only. Nothing new have been added under launcher and camera. And these are the change logs which are related to system, network, cloud service, work-life balance and cricket scores. First one under system it says optimize the RAM management. So here they have done few optimizations related to RAM management. It is not a noticeable change because I have been using it from yesterday. After that they have improved the black and blank screen issues with some applications. So you guys let me know in the comment section below after this update how many of you still face the issue of black and blank screen. Then they have improved the system stability and later they have updated the security patch to 1st Jan 2020. Next change log is related to network which says integrated the Wi-Fi registration for the Geo SIM. Yes, officially Geo was not supporting OnePlus devices. If you guys are using Geo SIM card, now you can enjoy Wi-Fi calling feature that can be found inside the settings, Wi-Fi and internet, SIM card and network, tap on the Geo and under enhanced communication, now you'll have a new option of Wi-Fi calling. If it is disabled, then you can enable it from here. And then you'll see this Wo Wi-Fi calling icon in the status bar. Before this only Airtel Wi-Fi calling was working on OnePlus devices. Now we have official support from Geo2. Moving on to the next change log which is related to cloud service that is again for Indian region which says supported synchronization with notes and contacts. So cloud service can be found inside the settings. Inside the settings you can find this option of cloud service where you can see you have options to sync your notes and contacts also now. Initially only photos were able to sync in the cloud services but now these two extra options have also been added. Then talking about the next change log which is related to work life balance that's again for Indian region only which says optimize message notification, optimize the mode and app selection, added location, calendar, auto track feature. So work life balance option can be found in the notification panel. Here you can see a small icon which is of work life balance. You can just tap on this. If you have already done the setup, you'll get these two options. Tap on the settings and from here you can configure your work mode and life mode. You can manage all the applications from here which are required or which are not required during your working hours. You can add the location, Wi-Fi options have been given and you can also schedule your work mode. And you guys let me know in the comment section below how much useful is this feature for you guys. And now moving on to the last change log which is related to cricket scores. Added cricket score as a card in shelf for quickest access to live scores. So here you can see we have a card of cricket scores. So guys this was a quick look on Oxygen OS 10.3.1 for OnePlus 7 Pro. Now let's take a look at the benchmark results. With Geekbench application single core have scored 761 and multi core have scored 2685 and with Antutu benchmark application device have scored 4,74,116. So guys this was all about the latest update of OnePlus 7 Pro. If you still have any kind of questions you can let me know in the comment section below. This is your friend Ashok signing out. See you guys in the next video.